Uh, my name is Isabella Obara. I work for the Independent Medical Legal Unit. We have received a petition that was sent to the Independent Policing Oversight Authority on behalf of the Civil Society Forum um, in Migori. And obviously we were alarmed at the heinous way in which uh, the Isabania uh, protesters were handled. And for us, we know for a fact that um, protesting or lobbying or picketing is an absolute right. So in the event that we deal or rather we undertake a crowd management, we don't call it crowd control, it's crowd management in that sense, then you know for a fact that IMLU will proceed. So our, our plan today is that we'll undertake legal documentation and collect anything that we have in our space and obviously we hope that we have next legal steps especially in, 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 in court for sure because we still believe uh, from what we've seen in Migori that courts are at least the safest spaces where we can challenge the use of power and excesses of the same. Neleomia wakati wa election 2017. Siku ya leo tumekutana hapa tena. Ninaomba sirikali wetu atusaidie juu mimi nilipigwa risasi na nileumia. Tangu tuumie tumekuwa tuli report tulikuwa na OB number Shirika ya Imlu walikuja wakatusaidia kufuatilia hii kesi tuko naye wametusaidia sana ambaye tunaona ni kama tunaweza faulu kwa hii kesi yetu lakini tunaona serikali watusaidie hatua yangu ya kutafuta haki imechukua muda mrefu sana na kwa wakati huu a Nina, 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 nina matarajio makuu kuwa serikali ikiweza kutusikiliza vile tumekuwa tukilia tangu huo wakati wote waweze angalau kutupatia hata kitu kidogo ili tuweze kufuta nayo machozi juu yale ambayo tumeyapitia ni machungu sana kama mimi ile gharama yenye nilitumia katika matibabu yangu ilikuwa pesa kubwa sana